Hi, this is Stephanie Manley with copycat.com. Today I'm going to show you how to make twice baked potatoes. These are a wonderful side dish to make for a holiday or any special event because you can cook these ahead of time and just simply reheat them right before serving. So they are a great addition to a special meal and they also look kind of fancy. So why not go ahead and give these a try? So all I've done is I've pre-baked these potatoes. I, these are kind of small potatoes. I don't want to use a large potato for this because I want something nice and a little bit more delicate. So I baked these for about 45 minutes and now I'm going to show you how to go ahead and cut these potatoes and go ahead and scoop them up and get them ready to stuff them so they'll be really, really good. So we are simply going to take and we're just going to nick off like the top third of the potato here like this. And then this side, I'm just gonna simply dump all the way into the bowl. And then for this end, I'm gonna kinda scoop it out like a little boat. Now I just want to scoop out the insides so I can use these potatoes and then stuff them. You don't wanna go too close to the edge because if you do that, it's gonna break apart on you. So just kinda be careful. And once I get these all cored out, I'll go ahead and show you how to make the stuffing and fill them. So let me tell you a couple of things about these potatoes. Now, before you bake them, wash them and make sure they're nice and clean. And secondly, you can also eat the skin. I get people asking me that question all the time. Yes, the skin is perfectly edible and all the nutrition is actually, or not all of it, but a lot of it's in the skin. So go ahead and be adventurous. Try eating the potato skin. So now I have all these potatoes scooped out and I have them in a bowl. And I'm just gonna mash them up with a fork. I'm gonna add a couple of tablespoons of butter to this. So what you can do with these is put everything that you love in a baked potato already in here. So it tastes just like a baked potato. I'm gonna add some sour cream. Then I'm gonna add some of the cheese here. I'm not gonna add all of it because I'm gonna put a little bit on top when we're done. Then I'm gonna add some of my bacon as well. I've just cooked bacon. If you can use bacon bits, it's great. And I'm gonna use a little bit of scallions. You could also use chives, both work really well. We're gonna go ahead and add some salt and some black pepper. So we're gonna stir these together and then we're gonna fill them with our potato. So now it's time to go ahead and stuff these potatoes. So you're just gonna take some of the stuffing mix and just scoop those right into the hollow portion that you took out. Now you're gonna end up with more mix than what you started with. So go ahead and let these kind of mound up. They'll be pretty. And when we get done with this, we're gonna go ahead and use the broiler function in the oven. So every oven has one of these, you just click it on to broil, and you're gonna broil these until they get a little bit brown on top. So at this point, I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit more cheese. And when this cheese melts, I know that they'll be done. Now, if you're gonna go ahead and reheat these, you're going to need to put your oven on about 350 and heat them up for about eight to 10 minutes. And then you can put on a little bit more cheese and broil them so the cheese turns nice and brown. So we have taken these out of the oven. I put them in the broiler. It took just about five or six minutes and you can see the cheese is wonderful and brown. And just before serving, I'm gonna go ahead and top these with a few more green onions. and a little bit of bacon, and we're gonna go ahead and serve these up, and that's it. So if you enjoyed this recipe, please go ahead and subscribe to this YouTube channel. 
so you can see more great recipes here at copycat.com.